Hi, it's Wanda from Alanda Craft and this is our Quilt Block channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make this gorgeous Austin Star Quilt Block. So let's get started. So you're going to need two pieces of fabric that measure six and three quarter inches. You'll need a piece of fabric that's five and a half inches and you need to make sure that one of these pieces and this piece match because they're going to form the star and then you want four pieces for the corners that are three inches square. So now we need to make some half square triangles and you can see these around the edges of the pattern. So there we are. So we're going to go and construct those next. Now if you're not familiar with making half square triangles we do have a tutorial. I'm just going to go through the basics of it today. We need eight of them and what we do need to do is take our two six and three quarter inch squares of fabric and place them one on top of the other. Now you draw a line from corner to corner, from point to point, and then you are going to sew a quarter of an inch from that line all the way down and then you'll come back and you'll sew a quarter of an inch on the other side because that's going to be our cutting line. So we want a quarter of an inch this way as well and a quarter of an inch from the line that way. Then when we come back after we've sewn it, we'll cut down the middle and then we'll cut across the middle here and the last steps we'll do will be to cut on our drawn line and that's going to give us eight half square triangles. So now I've sewn and cut my eight half square triangles and now I'm going to press them. So I'll just take one and we want to press it to the dark side so we set our seam on that side. Let's open now triangle, give it a good press. So I'll do that with all eight of them. So now we're going to start sewing our block together and I'm going to start with the top row and what I'm going to do is take the square and just put it on top of the square and sew down here with a quarter inch seam and I'll do the same with the other two squares, just sew them together. Then when that's done and they open up then I'll just sew the two middle pieces together and that'll make one, one line. I'll do that for the, the top and also for the bottom. Okay, so I've sewn the top and the bottom, as you can see here. I'm not going to press them at this point. Now I'm going to go and sew the side pieces. So I'll take those two pieces and put them together and sew them along here. And these ones the same, sew them along here. So as you can see, I've sewn my side pieces together, but I've gone ahead and I've pressed the middle seam open. So you'll do that on both sides. Just press that open there. Okay, so now that they're ready, I can go and attach them to the middle piece, which I'll do. I'll lay that over there and sew it down here, and the same with the other side. Okay, so I've uh, sewn all those together, and now what I'm going to do is just show you how I've pressed it. So the middle one section I've pressed with the seams coming into the middle, and the top and bottom I've, I've pressed with the seams going to the outside, and you can see the middle are all opened. Okay, so now it's just a matter of sewing the top to the, to the middle. So I'll do that, and then I'll also sew the bottom to the middle. So I'll go and do that, and then bring it back and show you what it looks like. Okay, so there's our block finished, and I think it looks really quite cute. So if you've enjoyed this tutorial, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And thank you for watching.